a three-and-a-half-hour match saw the Brazilian return to the court in impressive fashion. Tennis star Beatriz, Bia, Haddad Maia has returned to the court in impressive fashion following a shower accident that saw her needing stitches on both of her hands. The Brazilian came from behind to secure victory over Aleksandra Sasnovic at the Hong Kong Open, in a moment that showcased the grit and determination of the national hero. Haddad Maia's season was thrown into jeopardy in September when she was forced to withdraw from competing at the Guadalajara Open. The world number 18 was set to face America's Danielle Collins in the quarterfinals of the competition but was ultimately replaced by Sakia Vickery. Haddad Maya announced on social media that an accident in the hotel bathroom saw her require medical treatment and stitches, with the shower said to have exploded and consequently shards of glass striking her and needing to be bandaged up. Despite the significance of the incident, which saw the 27-year-old have both of her hands treated, Haddad Maya returned to the court in style when getting the better of Sasnovic in Hong Kong. In a match that lasted three and a half hours, the second seed secured a 7-6, 3-3-6, 7-6, 3-6 success at Victoria Park. The marathon win was no easy feat for Haddad Maya, who reached the semi-finals of the French Open earlier this year. The Brazilian came back from 4-5 in the final set to secure the win, just 23 days after sustaining her glass-related injuries. After her withdrawal from the Guadalajara Open was announced, Haddad Maya announced what had happened on Instagram to provide her supporters with a thorough explanation of the circumstances and why the matter was taken out of her hands. She wrote, Last night, Sunday, at the hotel, getting out of the shower and opening the shower box the door just popped and I ended up cutting some parts of my body. I had to go to the hospital here in Guadalajara to get stitches, between them in both hands, and unfortunately I will not be able to play here in Mexico, special place for us tennis players due to all the responsiveness of the people and efforts of the tournaments. Besides the scare I am fine it could be something much more serious. I will need a few days now to heal the wounds and be able to be back for the latter part of the year, and keep fighting for my goals for 2023. I appreciate the affection and good vibes from everyone. Have a nice week and see you soon.